Hi guys, so I'm going to show you how you can have a dental implant placed on the same day as having the old tooth taken out and having a false tooth there in place from day one. Um, this is really great because you don't need to wait for the bone to heal when you take the tooth out and you don't have to wait sort of three, four months for the implant to heal before you can have a fixed tooth put into position. Okay, now I will warn you, one of the teeth, one, or sorry, one of these photos that I'm using does have a little bit of blood, but to, to soften it off, I've just made that photo black and white, but I'll warn you before that comes. Okay, so this is Catherine. Catherine came to see me because of her front left tooth. Here you can see it a little bit more clearly here and if you see it from the, the biting surface of the tooth this is what it looks like. Now when we we're planning this I first made a model of the tooth and I repositioned, I cut the tooth off and put it in the position that we want it. This let me visualize the where the tooth should be and it makes implant placement more accurate. The next photo I'm going to show you with uh, during the implant surgery. Okay, so you can see the implant is in position, and I've made a little matrix we call it um, to help me get the shape and position of the temporary tooth exactly right. The temporary tooth is made outside of the mouth, and then we just uh, stick it in. Okay, and then it's a case of just letting the whole whole thing heal. Um, you can see that the implant tooth is a little bit shorter. Uh, two reasons for this, because um, we actually made both of the front two teeth shorter, it looks a bit better like that. Um, but also this tooth, because we put it in on the implant straight away, it, it is um, designed only to be there for decoration. It's not there to, um, to take biting loads and things like that. If you start doing that, then the implant's gonna fail. So we left it for about three months to heal and then it's a case of just getting the colour right and making a final crown so that it looks beautiful. So this is the final crown and then right at the end we did a little bit of tooth contouring to help get the, the levels a bit right. Now Catherine had a gap between her teeth before anyway and this is what her this is what she wanted she was really happy with this result because the teeth look symmetrical the gap is there which was always there and the the tooth which we took out was um, a diseased tooth and the implant's going to last for a really long long time if you've got any questions about this kind of treatment yeah please do ask um, or if you're considering having dental implant treatments and you want my opinion just come in and see me for a free consultation no problems um, just give the clinic a call and, and they'll arrange everything for you.